Tonight, Team 10 is following millions of your tax dollars as they pay for free rides for state justices. Investigator Mitch Blocker found the California Highway Patrol running what some are calling an armed taxi service. This unmarked car pulling out of the Capitol complex in Sacramento is just one of dozens driven by plain clothed Highway Patrol officers. 25 in all staff the CHP's Judicial Protection Section. Contracts and invoices obtained by Team 10 show protecting California's appellate court justices cost taxpayers $21.7 million since 2009. $1.5 million was spent on overtime alone. There hasn't been a justice who's been physically attacked, at least in the 30 years I've been doing this, I don't know of any. San Diego Superior Court Judge Tony Mano has seen the judicial protection firsthand. My information is that there's been some CHP officers that have driven justices to the airport. One of them is California's former Chief Justice Ronald George. He detailed one free ride in his book, The Quest for Justice in California. He wrote his CHP escort Terry drove us to the airport to begin our long journey to Antarctica. There's no mention of what judicial business he had there. Back in Sacramento, we watched judicial protection cars take up about a half dozen parking spots in the roundabout across from the Capitol. We tracked the license plates and found days when the same car would travel from Sacramento to the state Supreme Court in San Francisco. Last I checked, it was a pretty safe road from Sacramento to San Francisco. We went to the Court of Appeals for answers. They told us to talk to the CHP. A CHP spokeswoman would only talk to us off camera. She said we are aware of threats justices have received and that she could not speak further about security. There were no answers why more than a million dollars was spent on overtime and nearly a million more on mileage charges. The CHP has basically said we can't provide that level of detail because it would jeopardize security. Do you buy that? I, I, I don't. Justices hear appeals cases and have less direct contact with the criminals than the judges who sentence them. We did get one comment from a retired justice. It's just complete nonsense, totally inaccurate that the CHP chauffeurs uh, appellate justices from their homes to work every day. That's just nonsense. Arthur Scotland retired in 2010. Ironically, we caught up with him at a hearing about how the state courts spend the public's money. Now we checked with the most populated states in the country, including Texas, New York, Florida, and Illinois. Not a single one has anything approaching the costs of California's judicial protection. Now, Mitch, is there anyone that's trying to stop them from spending this money? No, there have been all sorts of audits, all sorts of hearings, all on how the state courts spend money, but there's not a whole lot lawmakers can do about the spending on security. The only person who can really put a stop to this is California Supreme Court Justice. She has the power to cancel that CHP contract. All right. Thank you, Mitch.